The historic difference between Labor and the Liberal Party is that Labor was quite sceptical of capitalism and it believed that we needed to have a big role for government to curb capitalism successes. So they wanted uh, there to be more government laws constraining big business. They wanted to tax the rich to redistribute money to the poor and to have government paying for things like public health and public education. The Liberal Party, on the other hand, saw big government as being a threat to, to individual freedom. And so they argue for a more small government, kind of free market, user pays sort of a system. Um, so that's a really fundamental difference. You can get the impression that major parties are pretty much the same. Actually, they're more different than they appear and that their deep ideologies actually are more of an indicator of what they're going to do in government than what they're telling you their election policies are. So even going into this election, we've got Labor promising to tax the rich and redistribute to the poor and to put a lot of money into public health and to public education. Um, we've got the Liberal Party saying Labor's going to be big, going to be a big tax in government and the threats to individual freedom and individual wealth presented by their policies.